Hey, welcome back to the channel. Alison Ramirez here, Christian author, editor, and content creator, here today to talk with you about my new story binder. Uh, I just came off of attending the Catholic Writers Guild Conference for 2022, and it was a fantabulous, did I say fantabulous? <laughs> Fabulous weekend um, where I got to meet so many other wonderful writers, authors to be, um, and authors, and we just got a chance to listen to a lot of great presentations and panels um, on all sorts of topics having to do with being a Christian writer. Um, there was a lot of networking opportunities, uh, and I met so many amazing people, and I'm so excited to finally start some critique groups for fiction and nonfiction for my, my books that I have either written or currently written. And today, though, I'm going to be sharing with you about my story binder because I got to be one of the presenters of the conference, which I'm so grateful for. That was an amazing opportunity. Um, and I spent several weeks, actually about a month, preparing for my presentation. Uh, my presentation was all about how to create a story binder for your book. So I thought I'd create a debrief video about some of the key points that I talked about in my presentation and also share with you that I have a 30 page template that's part of my online newsletter that I sent out each month. Uh, so if you go to my website, uh, authorallisonramirez.com, on the very first page there is a newsletter sign up uh, and if you put your name and your email you'll automatically be sent that free 30 page template all about organizing your characters and your world and your publishing plan and your writer life. So. A lot of time went into that template, so I really hope that it benefits you. So feel free to uh, make use of that. Specifically though, I'm going to be talking about a story binder for your book or book series. What this is, is a place where you can keep track of all of your notes and all of your writing, your revisions, your drafts. Specifically, if you're somebody writing fiction or you're someone writing a series, a binder can be really helpful just to keep everything in place. But specifically, there are four parts of the story binder in my template, at least, uh, and that is the publishing plan for your individual book, your actual story Bible, and that's everything about your characters and your world and your research and your point of view and genre and all that. Uh, your author platform, so this is your ideas on promoting and marketing your book, this is your presence on social media, uh, this is any other efforts that you have, any other content you're creating um, having to do with your brand and your author uh, existence. Finally, writer life goes into um, the behind the scenes of producing creative work. This is your writing routine, this is all the places you like to network, inspirational, motivational quotes for you as an author that inspires you in your writing journey. Um, your routines and processes and why you're doing what you're doing. Um, so again, that binder can be a physical binder, such as the one I have here that I got off of Amazon. It's super helpful because it has a lot of tabs and places to just like keep track of everything. This could also be virtual uh, on folders on your computer where you just have like the name of each book and you know all about your characters. You could have webs or templates for keeping track of everything about your characters. You can also use Pinterest to save pictures that remind you of your characters. You can create a writer playlist to listen to to inspire you as you're writing. Um, I also have a lot of links to um, other YouTubers that I found helpful on my self-publishing journey because I should mention that my experience in writing has been self-publishing. I self-published my very first book, a Christian devotional journal called Breathe Deeply, The Joyful Mysteries of the Rosary as Invitations to Peace, which is available um, for purchase on Amazon as a paperback and a Kindle. But I self-published that book and so this template can help you whether you're self-publishing or traditional publishing, but just know that my background is in self-publishing. Um, and so, yeah, I hope that this uh, creating a binder can help you uh, track your journey. I would also recommend that if you are writing multiple books to have an individual binder for the publishing plan and the story bible for that particular book, and then you can have a bigger binder that's ever growing about your author platform and your writer's uh, journey. So I'd recommend that there if you're keeping a physical binder. Um, the publishing plan section of the binder just goes into all of your goals and your timeline and your checklist where you can put like 
when you want to complete your first draft, when you want to finish your revisions, when you want to send your draft to beta readers or critique partners, and when you want to bring in an editor and work on your cover and all those elements for publishing a book. So again, that is my story binder template. You can get for free on my website and that was a little bit of what I discussed at my presentation at the Catholic Writers Guild, which they have a yearly conference. Usually it's maybe the second week in February. The conference was all day Friday, all day Saturday, and all day Sunday. So it does take up your entire weekend, but I would highly recommend it. It's completely worth it, uh, especially if you are a writer of faith, particularly from the Christian background, and you want to connect with other like-minded people um, and just grow in your knowledge of writing, editing, and publishing books and sharing your message and bringing that larger message to the world and to your readers. So that is my little um, video for today. I hope you found it helpful. If you have any questions or comments, go ahead and leave them down below. Uh, also, please go ahead and like and subscribe to this channel if you find this information helpful. And I look forward to talking with you again soon. Take care and have a great day. Bye-bye.